Hello guys, it's Mike and today we are not gonna have tutorial, it's gonna be kind of experiment or rather myth busting because after Unreal 5, uh, Unreal Engine 5 uh, advertisement was showed, people start to talk about how many polygons software can handle and it starts to be really important and that's this is how people start to judge software and i don't know why but blender is um, at the bottom of this list there is a lot of memes that are trying to convince us that blender can't handle polygons i had also a few conversation at blender's um, group on facebook and people that showing their works they are saying that they are not able to handle more than six million scoped in blender or 10 or there is comparisons and always there is something I don't experienced so I just want to make this short video to show you that basically you can use uh, high poly meshes in blender you can scoped high poly meshes in blender I usually work with 3d scan data so I don't have this problem I don't have problem with uh, with 10, 15, 20, 30 million poly meshes. I don't have. So what I did, what I did, I subdivided uh, uh, Suzanne, as you can see. This is 47, 47 million poly, uh, million poly mesh. And, uh, oh, we have lag. Oh, so maybe it can't handle. No. I'm just kidding. I don't know. Sometimes, sometimes we have like a small freeze with this number, but uh, in, in general, I think it's more about hardware limitation, not about software limitation, because as you can see, everything is smooth. Everything was, uh, it's, it, it's working right. I mean, okay. So let's try to sculpt something. Uh, I think it's like a few thousands polygons moving at now at once and it just works. If, oops, if we come closer, it works. If we go further, okay, it slows down. But now we are moving few hundred thousand polygons. And remember, this is not six or 10 million polys, it's almost 50. And you don't really need to sculpt 50 million poly mesh. Yeah, usually you don't need to. So this is kind of special uh, stuff. And let's see about memory consumption is 20 giga. 20 giga, giga, I don't know. Uh, okay, it's a lot, but it's nowadays people just just do it. They, they just have like 32 uh, gigabytes of RAM. They they just have it. 16 is standard, 8 is short, and this is 50 million polys, not six, not 15. And basically, this is what I wanted to show you that Blender can handle high resolution meshes. You can sculpt meshes like 50 million polys and i have only on this pc i have only first generation of ryzen cpus so 100 million polys was not working good for me uh, that was a little bit laggy a little bit slow but if you have newer pc newer newer cpu uh, generally i think you would be able to sculpt 100 million polys and I saw already videos about 80, 80 millions, but that was private videos. So I'm not gonna link it. I'm not gonna mention it, but basically it works. So that's it for now. That's it for today. That was just like short uh, myth, bu myth busting. So, okay. Thank you guys for, for watching and hope you see you soon. Bye.